Get it started here. Okay, so I I got a sideways video somehow, so I'm just gonna hold this straight up. This is Paul Bliss, cowboy poet. I'm ready. Are you ready? Well, whenever you feel like you're having a really bad day, I want you to remember this poem. Dear boss, I write this note to tell you of my awful poem. Because at this time of writing, I am not a pretty sight. My body, tis all black and blue. My face, a deathly gray. I write this note to tell you why Paul is not at work today. While working at the stable, some poor shoes I had to clear. Throwing them from off the loft was not a good idea. The foreman, he's an honorary cuss. Gosh, he's always on my back. He said I had to haul him down the ladder in a sack. Now hauling all those shoes by hand, it seemed so awful slow. So I hoisted up a barrel and secured the rope below. But in my haste to do this job, I was too blind to see that a barrel full of horseshoes would be heavier than me. So when I climbed down, untied the rope, the barrel fell like lead. And clinging tightly to the rope, I started up instead. Yes, I shot up like a rocket. But to my dismay, I found that halfway up, I met the doggone barrel coming down. Well, the barrel broke my shoulders towards the ground it sped. And when I reached the top, I smacked the pulley with my head. But I held on, though numb with shock from this gosh almighty blow. And the barrel spilled out half the shoes down on the floor below. And when the shoes had fallen from the barrel to the floor, I then outweighed the barrel and I started down once more. Still clinging tightly to the rope, we fell towards the ground, and I landed on those horses that were scattered all around. Laying there in misery, while I thought I'd pass the worst. That's when the barrel hit the pulley and the bottom of it burst. A shower of shoes came down on me. Oh, I haven't any hope. And as I was losing consciousness, I let go of the rope. Now the barrel being heavier, it started down once more and landed right across me as I laid it on the floor. Oh, but my faithful dog, yes, man's best friend, came over to check on me. He sniffed my head and licked my cheek, then cocked his leg to pee. Uh -huh. I broke three ribs, a shoulder, and my left arm, and all that I can say as I hope you'll understand why Paul is not working today. Thanks, Paul. You're welcome.